So I don't want to bore you with all the rest of the stuff that people may say, so I'm just going to get to the meat and the potatoes of this type of commentary. I got all the clips and I purposely went through his streams, which is two streams over like eight hours, nine hours. And I want to show you guys all these clips all together without anybody knowing people talking through it and blah, 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 like I am right now. I really dislike stuff like that. So let me just tell you right off the bat, this man jumps back and forth and back and forth and back and forth between the reasons why he's got banned. But let me just show you some stuff right here. I feel like I've earned at least a fucking phone call or someone to, I mean, I did have a phone call, but most of the shit that they were saying, it was just like, I'm not at liberty to discuss this due to my security fucking bullshit with the security, dude. The reason I showed you this clip is because simply his teammates later on in the game have asked him, dude, what is your relationship like with the people with Call of Duty, basically? And he said, well, he doesn't know. And pretty much he's not on the whitelist anymore. He specifically states he thought he was. Let me move on to the next clip. You're an idiot. Thank you, though, for I just you guys. I don't know if something's on my PC that's causing this shit. I just I don't want to fucking I don't want to take anyone's PC and something happens to them. And I'm the reason why your account's banned. What level am I? So basically what he's saying here is that if he logs in to somebody else's computer, there's a possibility that it might get banned. But then how it, can you log in if you're, you can't log into your account, bro, you're banned. I guess I assume they automatically know that he's gonna be on a new account. I don't really know, but this just, this is just, he just, what? What did he say this for? You log into somebody else's account under a new account, that just means you're under a new account. It means nothing. You can do the same thing on your PC. You're not hardware ID banned yet. I don't even know if I can say that. I mean, I don't even know if, I mean, apparently they found evidence on my machine while my game was running that had unauthorized software interfering with the game. That's what I was told. All right, so now he admits it. He had unauthorized software running. Well, at least Call of Duty said, you have unauthorized software running on your PC. Now, if any one of us, smaller streamers, you know, any one of us, had unauthorized software running on our PC, what do you think everybody else would say? Next clip. Like, they, I mean, they I said that they did a deep dive into my account and fucking apparently that I had something running while I was playing the game that caused Ricochet to fucking permanently ban my shit account. Oh, oh, no, what? I don't even know what it is. Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Now listen to that. He's finally admitting little by little, smaller and smaller things. But of course he has the email and he knows everything that actually is told to him in the email. And what is relating as time goes on is he's saying that look there's something on my computer but without actually saying there's something on my computer let's move on and i've asked is for them to take over my pc and to tell me what is wrong with what, what, what i did wrong that's that's what i've asked that's what i'm waiting to fucking hear back dude i mean this is literally my fucking career dude so yeah and i mean it, it would be a waste i have nothing i literally have nothing to fucking hide I need to talk to one other person about fucking, I mean, I don't know. Specs is, uh, we need to talk to Specs. But Specs hasn't been on my account since, since last year, but apparently. Apparently if someone else fucking was on my account with a fucking, at any point in time, I can get fucking permanent. I mean, I I don't know. I just I just would love to have a, have an actual answer after everything that I've done over the last six years playing this game. So here's the buildup, the kind of clip that you probably pretty much seen where he says, "Hey, I uh grinded my camels. Oh, oh no, never mind. I let somebody else grind my camels and I paid them." The typical freaking excuse that most YouTubers have actually used in the past when they got permanent banned. So he's building up to that point right here. This guy named Specs is the guy that actually he said that he paid. Now, how many times have we heard this before? Do you actually really believe it? It's his livelihood. And I understand that. So what he's trying to say is, look, I make money doing this. And yeah, you're taking my money from me. Let's move on. No, that was, they did that like in a, in an actual game. Like the hacker got into the same game as them and then he like injected cheats like in the game. It wasn't like into his PC though. Uh, 
Because yeah, if, yeah. I, if I had cheaters in my game, like I've been getting fucking harassed by this P, PX clan for the last like week. And they've been stream sniping. Uh, they're and still hacking. around? Yeah, they've been stream sniping and hacking. And I was wondering if they somehow did something sus. It was either that or fucking the person that I paid to level up my guns. But that's they have not logged into my account. I looked since December. Yeah, I have no idea. I just wish they'd give an answer, though. I know. They haven't told me that. That's all I want. And here we go. They just can't make up their mind, can they? They're talking about Valorant or Apex, whenever it was, that a hacker got into the game and somehow managed to put cheats through the game on another person's PC. Where do these guys come up with this crap? Where? And again, that he mentions the person that he paid that he put cheats on his PC. The same old story we heard before. And then again, he says, well, I don't understand the reason. They haven't gave me a reason of why I got banned. Uh, yeah. Unauthorized software on your PC. Yet again, we know this, right? Let's move on. Bro, what do you think, bro? Do you think I cheat, Husk? <laughs> no, dude, I've been telling my... I've gotten so many messages. Dude, do you think Bobby was cheating? Bro. I'm like, dude, that guy is the least sus Warzone player I've ever seen. Dude. The least sus player by this other guy who's been accused of cheating. Yeah, this other guy. I don't even know his name. FIFA Kill? What, what the hell is this guy's name? I don't even care. But the point being is, yeah, this guy is the least sus. But let me tell you something. You see, most people that have cheats most of them just download walls and bobby is what i like to call a, a lazy cheater they use their own kind of aim and kind of whatever it may be so it makes it the least sus at all for a time there in the, in the past it went around that if you just downloaded walls but used all your own aim your own map awareness your own everything except for the walls i heard that it makes it the least sus hence why i call this guy a lazy cheater also because of the fact that maybe i don't really think he uses the walls constantly 24 7. let's move on i did pay someone to level up my account so i mean just to be this sucks but it, it, this could be legit i mean i paid someone to level up my account as is a lot of people do i'm not the only person to do that like i level they leveled up my guns got all the camos i paid someone to do that the last time they've been on this account that was back in december of 2023 um, so I don't know if they downloaded cheats on their PC recently and that's why I got kicked or something. I, I don't know. I really don't know. Or I've been running into these PX guys who have been griefing me for the last week. They've been stream sniping and cheating and they, I don't know if there's some way, I mean, in Apex, apparently someone fucking was in the same game as Hall and they were able to put cheats on his P on his PC. So, I mean, I, I don't know. Okay, now, so here we go. He asked about the Apex guy. He downloaded cheats and somehow integrated them into the game. And the other person that's streaming had him in the game. Now he's trying to reiterate and sit there and saying that these guys who use Call of Duty or play Call of Duty have been stream sniping him. And somehow he's wondering if they injected cheats into his PC. Because technically, again, that's what they said. They gave him the reason that there is unauthorized software on his PC. Now let's move on to this next part. Listen. I'm not, I, it was not an unlock tool. My buddy literally leveled up my, he literally played all night. I would get multiple messages. I would get messages every single day about people seeing me a multiplayer. Um, I promise you guys, I, there was no unlock tool was used. All right, so now what he's saying is that his buddy unlocked the camos for him and sat there and gave him constant updates of where everything that he unlocked. People sat there and said, yeah, we seen you in the game, blah, blah, blah. But again, he states, there was no unlock tool used. So that means he was sure about it. So why is it he's going back in different parts or different statements later on about how he thinks that his buddy may have used it? If right here, after all this stuff happened, he said this. Mind you, I've been pulling this off his own YouTube channel. This is all in according to how he is saying it one after another, after another, after another. I am not pulling anything this out of context. This is not one part here moved around to be another part. This is all as I am watching. Let's move on. I told you guys I paid someone to level up my guns. Maybe he put fucking cheats on the account or something. That's the first thing. The second thing. Eyes up, you hear? The second thing is the cheaters fucking were in my game and somehow they put some shit on my account 
And there it is, the most famous part that you guys probably see on Twitter or around wherever it's circulating. There it is, he actually just said it. But this was after he said his friend got on his account and he gave him updates and blah, 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 blah. He said this after he already just said the previous statement. So which is it? You can clearly see that, well, liars can't really keep track of their lies. My, my lord. My lord. Oh. You got some, you got some goodies for Big Bob. Yeah, my lord. Remaining safe zone locations intel oh. is marked on your deck, man. Oh my. my. Gas is closing in. Side, my lord. Oh my god. I, That'd be there. Oh, to, you fucking yours. know me. Yes. Yes. Do you need that? No, no. So as you can see here, this is a common thing that big streamers ever have happen to them. A guy comes along who st basically stream snipes and gives them everything, cash, money, whatever they need. This is a form of cheating, but to me, I really don't care. I've had this happen to me because I'm a streamer myself. So you already know that this is just something I threw in there just so you guys could see. Yeah, anyways, this is just, yeah, whatever. Call it whatever you want to call it. Let's move on. That's f***ed up. I hear him shooting. Yeah, it's over game. That's a weird ass way to cheat. That's kind of got to be the most pathetic way of cheating. That's the most pathetic shit I've ever seen. Oh my god! Oh my god! Let's go! Okay, so like the reason why I put this clip in here is because this is one of the instances that where you was accused of cheating. How? Well, I know you guys don't see all this, and I'm not going to put all the video on here, but what it was, was for whatever reason, there was a person doing the stim, basically stimming in the gas to try to get the win. I've seen this done a million times, and I've done this a million times myself. But what it was, was the direction that he just automatically went in. He had nowhere of knowing, no way of knowing, of what direction to go in. Coincidentally, the direction he went in was where this guy was hanging out. Of all directions that he could have went in, he went in the straight direction where this guy was. And this is why this clip was sus. Let's move on. And last but not least, this little part right here. This is not my video. And I tried to look for these certain images and it really, man, you know, some things just take forever. So I'll give credit to this guy. I'll put his little uh, X down below or AKA Twitter. He did some stuff where he actually investigated this and kudos to the man. So long story short, this guy found or Discord, which was also put out there by Ziebler, a guy who is a phantom overlay cheat provider, I believe. I could probably get that wrong, but he was basically is a dude who provides cheats. There was a Discord of 55 people. And this guy pretty much puts it all together. So let's just let the man speak. I'm a cheating Discord in which they posted this message, product removed. Due to many bans in the sections, we have decided to remove our MW3 Proton and Bubble ESP chair. Now this was posted on 9-30-2024-1158, two minutes before midnight, before hitting October 1st. Do you know another creator that has also been banned on October 1st? I believe he's talking about Nuke Jesus, the other person that was, well, you know, you, you know the story. Yeah, I don't need to explain. Now we have a picture from another cheating discord confirming that the chair has been detected. It says stay off bubble ESP while we investigate the ban. Okay, so you understand anything yet? I hope you guys do, but pay attention to this next part. Now the thing with Bobby Pop Gaming is that he received that temporary ban not on October 1st, but a couple days after that. Now coincidentally, we have another picture here saying MW3 chair, I'm not going to name the chair, woofer is now available for purchase. Now this came out as soon as the bubble ESP and the proton chair have been detected. Now, I know I think I lost some of you all, but chair means basically cheating. It's another word for cheating. They just don't use the word cheating. They use the word chair because yeah, it's not banned. And all this coincides to a certain specific time and date. And guess what? Yeah, that all happened on the same day where he just, yeah, I mean, come on, he's lying, basically. But shortly after that, as of 6.49 this morning, there was another message that's talking about that chair that has recently been released saying, resolve the issue that was causing a small percentage of users to get banned. Now that is from the recent chair that was just updated after that old chair detection. Now the detection of that new chair coincides more closely with the timeline of Bobby Puff being banned. And last but not least, let me tell you, the Windows update. Let's just common sense. Now, if there was a Windows update that would get you banned, then that would mean that millions of people would get banned or thousands or whatever 
But point being is, hit the like button, hit the sub, because it takes a lot of work for me to do all this. It's just ignorant to think that a Windows update will think, oh yeah, Windows update, don't update, because guess what, it got me banned. No, no, it, it's not going to get you banned. It never has, never will. It's not anything that's even smart. It's just something that people grasp, grasp at. All these guys do is, is do stupid stuff, and they grasp at whatever kind of excuse they can because they got a big following and they got a lot of money coming their way and well you already know fame and all the rest of the stuff that comes with it so what better to sit there and say that the dumbest things ever coincide with what's going on and meanwhile the smaller streamers who do the same thing they just don't care to sit there and say they're cheating so mind you guys i've already said this don't give your money just to anybody that has good gameplay give your money to somebody who has a good personality someone that makes you laugh someone that makes you identify like man I could identify with this guy and not in that way you know what i mean but in a, in a fun way and it, and it makes you feel great it makes you feel whatever it is all them good feelings inside blah 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 anyways hit the like hit the sub and yeah i'm out